there is a feeling there and a, just such a different attitude. You feel just sort of like kind of a heavenly atmosphere. That's the only way I can explain it. When, when I looked up at that tree with, with big yellow blossoms and then these little, um, little yellow butterflies started flying around and then two doves came down and landed on the bird bath. I love the garden. I love all the trees and I love being able to look up and watch the movement of the clouds and so forth. Broadview was truly a nice operation, you know, because of its setting, this setting, and, and it kind of lends itself to thinking beyond the, the limitations of the moment, you know. What I love about Christian Science Nursing is uh, to see the perfect God and perfect man in each and every one who we meet. That includes all God's creation, uh, animals and birds and bees and whatever God has made. And uh, another thing I love about Christian Science uh, Nursing is it's based on purity. Uh, there is no matter. It's not a matter-based healing. Um, idea is pure. We don't use any medicine. We don't go to doctors or surgeons. And so I just love that concept of Christian science and nursing. Healing is, as, as I was explained years ago, is, is a revealing that our, our reality is, the reality right now is the allness of God. So perfection is the only reality going on all the time. It's not it's not something that we have to earn or something we have to get. It is something that is all that's ever going on. So um, there is no life, truth, intelligence, nor substance and matter. All is infinite mind and it's infinite manifestation for God is all in all. So there is nothing but healing. There is nothing but good. There is nothing but perfection right now. Christ Jesus, Paul, Peter, whenever they were implored for healing, they never said, yeah, I'll heal you, but come back in a week and I'll, we'll, I'll get back to you. It was immediate. The need was met immediately. So the time for healing, the, the, the time for healing has been now throughout all time. Healing is always happening. In fact, the healing is already there. We know that God creates each one of us perfect. We just have to realize that perfection. So it's not really a case of seeing a material thing become healed. It's just a question of focusing and, and understanding and realizing that truth about ourselves, that we are the way God made us. Talk about Jesus seeing man the way God sees him. That's really what we're trying to do every day, see man in their perfect selfhood. I have uh, an enlarged heart figuratively speaking. I have a, I believe, a great capacity to give, a, a great desire to give, and being a Christian science nurse is just a perfect outlet for it. A nurse is a nurturer, it's someone, it's holding dear, it's fostering. You know, there's nothing to do with a medical facility in nursing, it's a misconception, but if you really look up that definition, it's what friends do to each other. It's love. It's pure, unconditional love. That's what to nurse is. We all are nurses. We all nurture. It's the way God made us. Because to be made in the image and likeness of love, love is what we give. Love is what we do. I enjoy working with patients every day, come in the morning and may see smiling all the time and they said today is a good day today we enjoy the god give it us god show me how you know how to work with the killing it's like we are like we are the angels with god and bring love and truth 
the tools that we're given, you, it's like you're carrying a toolkit and you open your toolkit and you bring out that love, that unconditional compassion that Jesus, you know, it says, he, moved, he was moved with compassion, and then the healing was immediate. This is what you remember. You know, Mary Baker Eddy, if it wasn't for that Bible that she used science and health to explain, this was the basis of her healing, of her healing message. So we do the same thing here. You know, we refer to what we know to be true, and it sets us free every single time. There's no situation where this cannot Nothing can be handled with the truth that we are given in this beautiful ministry of Christian Science and Nursing. The people at Broadview um, are probably the finest people I've ever been associated with in my life. I had a personal tragedy last year and for which I couldn't have made it without Broadview. How are they going to play that? <laughs> I couldn't have made it. I wouldn't have fared nearly as well. I know in my heart that Christian Science Nursing has been a fulfillment of probably my dreams. Without real, it happened without me realizing it, and and it, and it has really is. I love it, and it's just everything to me. <laughs> People need help, you know, and um, we're that's. What we're supposed to do, the rich in spirit help the poor in one grand brotherhood. So um, that is our goal, to help each other and love each other. This Bravius family here, and I'm so grateful with Christian Science Nurse. But I like the various um, Mrs. Eddy hymns where you can sing them to different melodies. Mm -hmm. um, for instance, you can take Feed My Sheep to the tune of uh, Brahms Lullaby. All right, give me a little, let's hear the first verse. Really? Yeah. Shepherd, show me how to, no, that's, that's Elvis. <laughs> no, that was, I like that's, that one that, too. that's Elvis, I like that that's one Elvis, too. but anyway. 